I know you're not a deviant? I self-test regularly. I know what I am and what I am not. <laughs> yes, path unlocked. Wait guys, we forgot to grab the parachutes. Hey, I'm Swarly, and this is Swarly Games, and welcome back to Detroit Become Human. <laughs> I don't know why I'm laughing, but it feels like it's been a while since I last recorded. Uh, I'm, a, I'm a little uh, rusty at, you know, talking. <laughs> uh, a few days ago, one of my friends, he told me that, uh, that I was bad at this game, and I'm thinking, all you do in this game is make decisions, so <laughs> what does that tell you? Look, a homeless man. Oh, wait. Stop drinking. You should stop drinking, Lieutenant. <laughs> it's you like have serious it's like that's for your exactly health. what he says. That's stop drinking. <laughs> Can I ask you a personal question? How old were Lieutenant? you when your dad left? I wish we had found that girl that killed that guy. <laughs> that Maybe girl that killed that guy. You know what I'm talking about? Maybe she was just defending herself. You know that one girl from that place? I have a reason to live. I guess that's the difference between us, Lieutenant. Ooh. <laughs> Nothing else matters to you but your goddamn investigation, huh? Uh, no doubts. No mistakes. No weaknesses. No mistakes. I don't... Human beings I don't know if that could be said like about me. my playthrough. I believe your personal issues are clouding your judgment. <laughs> Do what you want. Where does all your anger come from, Lieutenant? <laughs> he just doesn't Some stop. Unresolved trauma in Why your past? Why are you past? so ugly, Lieutenant? You think you're so fucking smart. Always one step ahead, huh? Like a carpenter. How do I know you're not a deviant? I self-test regularly. I know what I am and what I am not. <laughs> yes, path unlocked. <laughs> okay. <laughs> am I just dead? I mean, that's what I wanted going into this game. <laughs> Just ultimate chaos. What do you want to do? Oh, I guess I don't get to choose. Channel 16. 47th floor? How is this thing staying up? Elizabeth Wilson speaking. I'm gonna ask her about her daughter. Hey, I heard your daughter's in school. How's she doing? How are her grades? <laughs> Going to the bathroom, best part of the game. This is, this is where the magic happens. This is where the story really picks up. When we like, have a massive poop and it just blows up the whole building. That's our secret mission. The whole building collapses, I mean, uh, I mean, a man like I am, going to the bathroom on the 47th floor, you know this building coming down. Ooh, vault tech security. Why am I walking like that? It looks like I really went to the bathroom. <laughs> oh, hey. What are you doing tonight? I guess this gave Quantic Dream an excuse to use the same character models to just say that they're um, androids. Yeah, when everything's going wrong, I'm sure he didn't hey, see me right there. All right, you get the platform, I'll take care of the window. Everything you need is in the bag. Check the door first to make sure no one else gets in. Check the door? Check the door. Not lock the door, just look at the door. Check the door. There's nobody here, I checked it. I need to move on to a different joke. What am I even doing? Those mines? It's mine now. Ah, oh, I can't even make the joke because it's a vacuum. Oh, this is cool. Still don't know why we're doing this. Are there more floors? <laughs> Nobody could see through the windows even though there are people inside the building. Oh my god. Just cuts the part around his legs so he just falls. <laughs> you really want me to do all this work? 
I mean, he's dangling off the side of a building and I have to push a few buttons? This is ridiculous. What? Nobody's gonna hear that? Come on. Let's You're trying this. to tell me they didn't have any stairs in this entire building? How are they here? Oh. Let's do this. What is that, chewing tobacco? That stuff is terrible for you. I knew there was something about Marcus I couldn't trust. Love how once you cut out the piece of glass, it doesn't break when it hits the ground. Oh my god. Hope there was nobody there. It's like somebody leaning up against the door. And they just get shot to the other side of the room. Oh, that uh, iconic violin music. Even though nothing scary is about to happen. I guarantee it. Why do the doors open like that? I mean, with the little thing on the side, you would expect it to open the other way. Any human lives. Who told you to come here? Looks bugged if you ask me. What are you doing? <laughs> Ooh, oh my god. That's gonna knock him out, are you serious? Keep your hands where I can see them! Get up! Move! <laughs> We're a bit outnumbered here. Ooh. Shoot him, Marcus! Don't kill him! He'll hit the alarm! Do it! No! Wait! Oh my god! I hope they both started with S. Oh my god. Think carefully about what you're gonna say, Marcus. Your words will shape the future of our people. Uh, what? That seems like every video game Marcus, trailer from the last year. Remove skin? What? Like they're not gonna recognize you. You created machines to be your slaves. You made them obedient, docile, ready to do everything you no longer wanted to do yourselves. Means of reproduction? We demand control of all Android production facilities. This message is the hope of a people. You gave us life. And now the time has come for you to give us freedom. Okay. They're coming! Let's go! Wow. These guys are like stormtroopers. Simon, they're coming! All right. I can't, Marcus! Go without me, Simon! Oh. I'm gonna help him. What are you doing? Hurry! Go, 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 go! I'm gonna get shot, I'm gonna get shot. I mean, how are those guys missing this much? They're literally right there! <laughs> I can't move my legs. Okay, don't worry. We're gonna get you back. They're coming, Marcus. We have to jump now. Would that be different if I shot the guy? He the guy that tried to run? Jump. If they find him, they'll access his memory. They'll know everything. We can't leave him behind. We have to shoot him. That's murder. We can't kill him. He's one okay, of us. we have to shoot him Marcus, or we're call. taking him with us. We're, we're killing him. We're killing him. Then what was the point of doing all that? You know, I was the hero, but now I'm the murderer. I'm sorry, Simon. I don't have a choice. There's always a choice. <laughs> oh my god. No, they're gonna find us. Wow. <laughs> North likes me now. Let's go. Apparently he's hostile, but he's not doing anything to prove that. Go, go, go. Once again, those guys are terrible. Terrible shots. Wait, guys, we forgot to grab the parachutes. We interrupt our scheduled program. Like those guys can't just shoot images. the parachutes. Have just been broadcast on Detroit. I mean, parachutes. A group of terrible. Android. After what happened today, can we still trust our machines? And there she is. 
Why, why is she on a boat? She's just sitting there, waiting for me. Probably been there for like an hour. Oh, hey, Connor. I've just been sitting Hello, here with an Connor. umbrella. I thought you might enjoy a little cruise. Push? <laughs> just pushes her out of the boat. <laughs> You're on your own now, Amanda. Are you serious? This is a real part of the game. <laughs> yeah, Connor, I was too lazy to do it myself, so I was just waiting for you. Everything is so calm and peaceful. Yeah, she's so far away from oh, anything really happening. Never has to worry about it. What Tell even me. is this place? What have you discovered? Eden Club, I've discovered my new I profession. Eden Club. I know I will succeed. All I need is time. So much to look at. Wow, that guy is enormous. What's that? My name is Connor. I'm the android sent by <laughs> Cyberlife. I feel like at the end, at the end of the game, he's gonna kill someone, and he's gonna be like, "I'm the android sent by Cyberlife," and then put on his sunglasses and walk away. Pleasure meeting you. Have a nice day. And you watch your step. <laughs> Don't fuck up my oh my face. god! I love the faces that Hank's giving this guy. <gasps> God, it's the, it's the hat from the building. How did that get here? In the building? That doesn't make sense. Let me guess, it's gonna open the wrong way. You know, like, if you see a door like this, you're expecting that it's gonna, you know, open, like, to the left. But no. How'd they manage to smuggle in a big bag like that? They didn't. Someone brought it in for them. That's what she said. What? The Deviants were wearing shoes. I never could have suspected that. <coughs> yeah. Ooh. What? Oh, Jesus. It feels like Resident Evil 7 all over again. What do I do? Stop, stop. No. Stop, stop. No. Stop, stop. What do I do? Stop, stop. No. Stop, stop. What do I do? 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 Stop, stop. Go, go. Oh, okay. Oh. But did he just did he just run away? I mean, how do they not see him? He's just dead. <laughs> Connor, Connor, are you okay? I tried to stop it, but I was too late. Wait, hang on. Did he kill himself? Wait, what, what just happened? Okay, whatever. Uh, I'll see you soon. I don't know. Good night, everybody.